While there are records of people surfing on the East Coast in the 1940s, George Pittman and Bill Wise were certainly two of the first surfing pioneers in the Mid-Atlantic area. Their involvement with the sport dates back to the late 1950s. Together, they opened the Eastern Surfer, the first real surf shop in Ocean City, Maryland. In this documentary, Bill courageously shares his stories and priceless photos depicting the early years of surfing in Maryland and Delaware. In spite of a tragic surfing accident in 1965 and the resulting confinement to a wheelchair, Bill has remained very involved in the sport, including a successful career as a surf photographer and writer. His positive attitude, as shown in this video, speaks for itself. Another longtime surfer, Skip Savage, talks about his early days of surfing in Florida, which eventually led him to open his own shop on the Gulf Coast in the mid-60s and then in Rehoboth, Delaware in 1967, Surf Shop East. Dana and George Smith have surfed together since the late 1960s. George was one of the first shapers in the area and marketed his boards under the name Bayside. The movie also includes some great old home surf movies contributed by Kip Martin, Neil Stevenson, and Mrs. Carolyn Soup. Although Dave Doc Dockowitz was not part of the original Ocean City surf crew, his knowledge of surfing from the mid-60s is a great addition to this work. Delaware surfer Jack Powell contributed some of his classic film as well. The power surfing by Jack, the Clark brothers, and Gary Revel at their secret spot will blow you away. You won't believe you're in Delaware. Jack is surfing just as well today. Also included are more current surfing scenes shot on one of those perfect days in September 2001.